that is chopper. Hello, Tani. Hey guys, welcome to Tony Skittles live stream oh. channel. What happened there, you know? Oh, thank there. God for that. <laughs> I don't know what happened earlier on, man. We got three people in the chat right now. Hell yeah. Hey, Darkside, Darkside Gamer, how's it going, man? Yeah, we play, we play retro games every day, bro. This is how we do. And we also play the latest online fighting games like Street Fighter V, Tekken 7. We also play retro uh, online games like uh, Street Fighter 30th Anniversary, Soul Calibur 6. This is how, what we do. If you are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and smash the like button. D9, hey, what up? How are you doing? Man, I'm really loving your, your latest tracks, man. Your latest music is awesome. You need to put it on Spotify. Yeah, That's you need to, to add your tracks to Spotify, man. You, you're really great. Go and smash that pot over there and you, you get food, uh, Predator. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm trying to dust that for the reason. Oh. Oh, you just made a, a new track. That's it. D9 is a hard worker right there. Wow. Oh, you thought I'd leave the yeah, email. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna check that out. I'm gonna check it out. Stop wow, that. we killed us both. Holy shit. Hell yeah, clothesline. Yeah, I'm playing as well. Yeah, we are both playing. Me and Predator Gaming HD. We are playing uh, online. That's the good thing about this collection. You can play these awesome uh, old school games online. Yeah, you can do uh, online co-op. That's amazing, yo. I never thought in a million years that you would be able to do this. <laughs> yeah, we are playing this courtesy of uh, Capcom Beat'em Up Bundle. The great collection for the PS4 uh, is also available on, on the Nintendo Switch, Xbox One and Microsoft, Microsoft Windows. Yeah, after Gaming HD, yeah. <laughs> I thought we did the Dave's awesome Mario Tower, eh? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> guys, if you guys are into Nintendo Switch, get ready because uh, over the next week I will be making a lot of videos uh, of uh, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. So yeah, if you guys are into... Oh, another day I need that for when... Oh, another, another day I need that for when I let me switch. My mate did do it too, yeah? And made oh, yeah, super, super You can do that top, you know, making levels like super hard level. No way. 
Holy shit. Tawak building. That's a myth. I played the first one, I made, I made some crazy shit I did. People don't even do it. Oh god. Yeah, it's a shame I didn't put the first one on the Switch as a, as a, as a, uh, uh, like a port. Come on. Oh yeah, you definitely, if you love uh, retro games, you're definitely gonna love this collection. This collection comes with Final Five, Warriors of Fate, Knights of the Round, King of Dragons, Armored Warriors, and uh, Battle Circuit. Yeah, six great beat em up from, from the Captain I... Golden Era of beat em up. Oh. Oh, I played yeah. them with the Dragon, this is on my channel if you haven't seen it yet. Oh shit. Here's this flipping idiot then. Okay, D9, no problem, bro. Anyway. Oh yeah. Wow, what's that flipping tiny arrow do? Shoot it, it doesn't go that far. I know, right? Oh yeah, you can see Now I think we're gonna get the bonus stage. We have to eat the whole, the whole chicken. The whole, the whole, whatever they do in, in, I also, I, the total. Yeah, it's the bonus stage now. Yeah. Whoever, whoever, whoever eats the whole thing first, wins the battle. Wins the challenge. <laughs> Check this shit out, yeah. This is so funny. Oh my god, who's gonna win? Ah, goddamn. Oh, damn. Oh. That was so close. <laughs> yeah, the green one won. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> yeah. yeah, they don't do games like this anymore. No, they don't. Retro games are the best, man.
bloody all this flipping. This is totally different in Streets of Rage 2. Dummy footer. God damn, these watches so it's so OP. Jesus. <laughs> oh no. God damn. Ah, uh, let me choose another character. I'm gonna choose Qatar this time. There he is. That's my favorite. Qatar is a beast, yo. Fatality right there. Kassar, uh, he managed to cut the dude in half. Look at that shit. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, a lot of the fourth and so The soon we uh, look alike, the three of them. They're three sisters, look at that.
Yeah, if you guys are enjoying the, the gameplay, let me tell you this game is available on the beat em up, Capcom beat em up bundle. It's a collection of uh, six great beat em ups, yo. Yeah. It includes Final Fight, Warriors of Fate, King of Dragons, Knights of the Round, Armored Warriors, and Battle Faces. And all these games can be played online. And for example, this game, uh, Captain Commando, I forgot about Captain Commando, yeah. It's also available in the, in the collection. Yeah, and uh, Battle Circuit, which is available for four players at the same time. Yeah, four players can be played, can play this game online. Four at the same time. That's crazy, yo. So yeah, if you are into beat em up, you definitely need to get this collection. This collection is available on PS4, um, Nintendo Switch, Microsoft Windows, and Xbox One. Jojo, do you have a PC by any chance? The reason why I'm asking if you have PC is due to uh, a really cool uh, application called Fightcade. Basically, what, what Fightcade does, it enables you to play all these old school arcade games online. And the best thing about it, you can get all these awesome games for free. On 5K, yeah. And another great thing, not only you can play them online, 
you can also play um, you can also play them using a PlayStation 4 controller or an arcade stick. That's what, that's what I found last night, Tony. You play, you play over the Super Fan Meet on. <laughs> I was playing that for a bit. Oh, yeah. So. I'm definitely gonna. I'll probably gonna play Double Dragon, Double Dragon 2 later on, so you guys can see. Yeah. That would be amazing. Definitely one of my favorite beat em ups of all time, Double Dragon 2. I also have Double Dragon, the original Double Dragon from 1987. But yeah, Double oh. Dragon 2 is definitely my favorite one, yeah. Yeah, that's Predator. Predator is playing with me. Predator is the guy in blue, and I'm the guy in gold and red. Yeah. Love yeah, we are playing this uh, online. Game Love is saying, hey Predator. Hello. I'm t I thought I I'm trying to train at the moment. We got six people in the house right now. Hey, walking, walking, so Cali. What up, yo? Welcome to the stream. This game that we are playing right now, um, Warriors of Fate. Yeah, Warriors of Fate can be played with three people at the same time, yo. So if there, if you are, if you have two. Two friends online, you can play with them. Three, three people at the same time, yo. That's sick, man. That's yeah. insane. <laughs> three player online co op, man. Can you imagine? If, if um, they would play with us like this. Well, I did invite MLA to this, but I knew that you wouldn't come, so. Anyway. I'm pulling them out. The funny thing is that ML MLA was actually one of the first guys to have this collection, but he never played it. <laughs> it's funny, right? Mm, I know, right? He only he only played this once. He only played this collection once. I'm, ta I'm Street Fighter, but are you? That's, that's another collection he doesn't play. Oh yeah, of course I remember Kung Fu on Nintendo, Jesus Christ. <laughs> I used to play it, play it all the time. <laughs> Oh, I, I I actually have good news for you, walk, walk, in, walk in SoCal. Um, do you have, so you have a Nintendo 4, Switch? By any chance? Let me know if you have PlayStation 4, uh, walk in SoCal. Yeah. Because if you do, I, I, I actually have good news for you, bro. Ah, uh, okay, you, you got PS4, so yeah, I got good news for you, bro. Do you, so you like uh, Kung Fu on Nintendo, right? So you're definitely gonna, you're gonna love the sequel the, to their game. The well, it's version. not official, it's not the official sequel to yeah. Kung Fu, but it looks, it, it look, the gameplay is exactly like the Kung Fu gameplay. It's called Vigilante. I don't know if you ever played Vigilante in the arcade back in the day. It's a 1988 uh, action fighting game, sort of, and uh, he uses the same techniques of Kung Fu. Yeah, and it's available on the PlayStation 4 at the moment, via the, uh, the arcade archive collection. Yeah, Vigilante, yeah, 
Go, go and get it now, it's really cheap. <laughs> yeah, Vigilante is available on the PS4. Absolutely. If you love Kung Fu, go and get Vigilante, man. You're definitely gonna love it, bro. And the best thing about about it, uh, the, it's enabled with turbo button and a limited continue. That's right. Vigilante, bro. And you hear you heard from me from me first from Tony Skittles live stream channel. <laughs> Hell yeah. And this is how we do at Tony Skittles live stream channel. We are here to support each other and help each other, yo. And at the same time we play retro games, we have fun. This is how we do. Hey! Cannot cannot attack wind. What up, yo? <laughs> That's a cool name right there. Yeah. <laughs> How you doing, bro? Welcome to the stream. We got six amazing people in the chat right now. So take this opportunity to grow your channel. Check each other's channels. Leave a positive comment on each other's latest Sammy. videos. And smash the like button. That's the right way to grow. Hell yeah. So where, where are you from? Come out to attack win. Where are you from? Me and Predator... Uh, well, I'm talking in London. I'm from London, UK. And Predator is from Wales. Well, my main language is English, so... That's right. Oh, cannot, wi cannot attack win is from California. Oh, yeah. How's the weather like in California, bro? Over here is absolutely freezing at the moment. Toes. Yeah, man. I'm pretty sure it's gonna snow soon over here. Yeah, yesterday we had some amazing, amazing gameplays on Cadillac and Dinosaurs and Golden Axe. Yeah, I was playing Golden Axe yesterday. If you missed it out, just go behind, go behind on my videos and you'll check the gameplay. I was playing with Tyrese Flair, the Amazon princess. <laughs> She's my favorite in, in Golden Axe. And my second favorite is the dwarf, Julius Thunderhead. Who's your favorite? Uh, who's your favorite uh, Golden Axe warrior, uh, Predator? Uh, no, the one with the with the sword thing. Oh, he looks like Conan the, Barbar the Barbarian, yeah. right? Yeah. Oh yeah, we we love classic games right here. Me and Predator, we play classic games all the time. Well damn fat bastards. Well, Don't forget guys, stay tuned for Double Dragon 2 gameplay today here at Tony Skittles live stream channel. If you are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and smash the like button. Oh, there you go. Game Lover has one subscriber, one new subscriber, courtesy of Camot Attack Win. Hell yeah. Attack Wins, I'll just do. sub to your channel. But, here we go. What the? I was trying to do something that throw you like a rat, though. Oh, I love that sword. <laughs> they go long distance, long distance attack. Awesome.
Oh, I lost my sword. DJ Graves is in the house. Yo, DJ Graves, how you doing? How are you doing today, bro? Welcome to the stream. We got seven amazing people in the chat right now. Come and chat with us, yo. Don't be shy. We don't bite, do we, Predator? No. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Someone's been leaving this out on my flipping live streams with that. I don't know who it is. Oh, yeah. Lover said, "Nah, he doesn't want to. Ch he doesn't want to talk because he's afraid of you, predator." <laughs> <laughs> oh God! How many? Oh, and Camot, uh, Camot, Camot wins attack. Uh, 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 he just uh, subscribed to you, uh, predator. Oh. Fancy. Yeah, guys, don't forget to check Come Out Attack Wind's uh, YouTube channel, yo. He's very supportive, as, as you guys can see. I'll just so that my watch check him out. I'll just tell you that my watch hours at the moment. Oh, yeah. Who the hell is this guy? <laughs> 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 Seen that before. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> that was funny. Even game love, even game lover is laughing. <laughs> yeah, random horseman right there. <laughs> Oh, and Dark Side Gamer has one more subscriber, courtesy of Camelot Attack Wind. There you go. Oh, you definitely need to eat, bro. That's teamwork right here. <laughs> God damn. Wild driver. Damn. 
Wow, he's got Blanca moves, yo. Oh, my God. One boss down. There's another funny bonus stage for you. Yeah. Right here, tell me. Do it now. Button chopper, do it now. Do it now. 
Mann! Nou, dat is het zappen. Pot, 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 die down. Doe het, de man. Ja, wat een twee bij. So there's, there's fish there. So there's food there. Oh my god, sorry about the interruptions guys. I had a few phone calls and shit. Yeah. Sorry about that. But I'm back now. <laughs> yeah, we got eight people in the house. Yo, eight amazing people in the house. Alright, let's continue. Do it now. Do it now. Get to the shopper. Tot tot die down, man. Tell me, my heer. Tell me. <laughs> God damn. This boss is OP. Look at this shit. Look at this shit, yo. Why the problem is shit five? 
<laughs> nah, they already got bloody, Dude. bloody theft and bloody you. <laughs> Fucking shit bastard, that is. I know. Very really good, loving, loving you. You've been playing with Gil a lot. Man, what I'm really hyped for is for that kickboxer in Tekken 7, yo. That's what I'm really hyped for. I know, right? Yeah, this game is available for three players at the same time. So yeah, three players can play this game online. This is definitely one of one of the longest beat em ups I've ever played. And the other long one is Tin of the Dragons, that's a long one. Oh, Even yeah, longer than this Dragons one. It's definitely a long one, yo. Because usually the majority of beat em ups, uh, you can play them, you complete, you can complete uh, a beat em up usually around 40 minutes, 45 minutes. Yeah. The quickest one is definitely Golden Axe. Jesus Christ. You can finish Golden Axe in 25 minutes. <laughs> I know. The arcade version, of course. I but, know, uh, it's beast. The, Gen the Genesis version is a bit longer it's... because it has more yeah. levels. But the arcade version, to... yeah, you can complete it on, 20, with, on 25 minutes. I know it's a beast as well, I think. Oh yeah, Ultra Beast, yeah. Because basically those games were just for you to uh, keep in 13 coins, basically. They, they were uh, coin munchers, those games, back in the day. It wasn't much, much about quality back in the day. It was all about for you to get more coins uh, available to to keep uh, in, yeah. to keep uh, playing, basically. Oh, I just use a straw. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh god, they thought it totally looked like. And the majority them. of the, these beat 'em up, you you re you really had to keep on pressing the buttons all the time. So that's why they introduced the the. The controllers with turbo buttons, especially for beat 'em up and uh, arcade Shoot em up. ups. Shoot 'em up, yeah. Because the majority of the old school games, you have to, you have to keep pressing the buttons all the time. Basically. Will this fat bastard die already? Hey, it's dead. No, he's not dead. What the hell? Jesus. What? And he's kicking your ass, too. There he is. Oops, sorry. 
That's all right. Hot pants. <laughs> this time, the dot end and oh, not the yeah. bloody dab. Bloody boulders. Jesus. Fighting in Emily's tassel. Uh. You need to play the Emily's and stop. And stop you avoiding to those. Yeah. Emily like, like, likes to avoid people, yo. I don't know why. <laughs> I'm telling you out, Emily, to stop. And stream this on your channel instead of flipping fighting games all the goddamn fucking time. Oh god. That's all he does, guys. Fighting really? games, fighting games. Yeah. No one is not drawing. Hmm. Just take this out as a some no, advice, Emily. Emily, Emily is actually a cool dude. He just needs to stop uh, just... ignoring people, man. Yeah. What the hell? I invite him to, for so many sessions. He, he, he doesn't even reply or anything. Dude, at least say, uh, I'm busy, Tony. I can't come. At least say that, you know what I mean? Rather than just ignoring people. I say it. I saw him t uh, playing Tekken 7 earlier, and I sent him a message. I even asked, MLA, could you invite me to your lobby so we can play together? He didn't even reply. I'm like, what the hell, man? What's wrong with this guy? <laughs> I know. And he can't say that uh, he, he missed the message, because I saw, I saw the online, the online live. Yeah, he was green. So he cannot deny the fact that... Uh, he knew that uh, I sent him a message. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's one thing that I hate is uh, people uh, that uh, act ignorant. I hate that shit, man. Mm. I hate that as well. I find I find that very uh, disrespectful. It is. Man. I know. Um, I think you need to. I think you need to respect people a bit more. Mm. I can understand that so sometimes you he, he might be busy, but yo, at least reply. At least say, listen, bro, I can't come at, night at the moment, or I can't do it. At least acknowledge. You know what I mean? Mm. Rather than ignoring, ignoring people, yo. If you watch this bath, I'm gonna do some advice. Stream different games on your channel. I used to stream Test 7 every day, but I changed my ways. Yeah, you can't. You cannot stream the same game over and over again because uh, people are going to start getting tired of of seeing the same thing yeah. on your channel all the time. This is the reason that's, why I play different rough. games all the time. I'm me, not an MLA. No, well, I need to have a ch we need to have a chat with him. If you really, if you really uh, want your channel to grow. Uh, if you if you are a gamer, you definitely have to uh, you have to play different games. You can't play the same game over and over and over again, because people will start getting bored of your channel. It's true. It's true. And you gotta make an effort to uh, make your channel a little bit of eye candy, eye candy material. 
And what I mean with eye candy material, I mean creating thumbnails, you know. Create uh, I'll just, I'll just, I'll just, thumbnails I'll just... for each video that you you make. That, that definitely helped your channel to grow. I dust that man off doodle. I don't have the time to make him. Yeah, man. That's what I'm really so do. You and just put uh, thumbnails you don't, on you don't really need a computer to create thumbnails. You can you can do it from your phone. Yeah. There are a lot of uh, thumbnail applications on Android and uh, iPhone, iOS, and they're all free. So why not most, take advantage? Most of them. Not all of them are free to only I taught none on that. Mm. Go and eat, you need to you need food. Done it anyway, but this should be some leave of lights. Whoa! You love stabbing people, yo. <laughs> God damn. Guys, if you love the Double Dragon series, later on I'll be playing Double Dragon 2 here on the channel. So stay tuned if you, if you like Double Dragon series, yo. For you, man, you need to put thumbnails on your videos. Oh yeah, that will. Yeah, damn. It looks like how much money we've spent so far. <laughs> oh god. Fancy for that vice for <laughs> we just drop that. <laughs> The next level is the last one. Oh yeah, this time don't let him in foot in the state. Yeah, that's the last one, yo. About eighteen, about eighteen levels. Oh yeah, King of the Dragons is definitely one of the longest get em up of all time. But it's dud though. It's like an RPG. Yeah, that's a great game, yo. Wow. 
But I, I still I still prefer Dungeons and Dragons, you know. Yeah. And they should have they should have put the, that that game into this collection. Yeah. I, I can't believe they didn't put they didn't put Dungeons and Dragons. At least it's at least it's on PS3 though. Yeah. And it's also oh. available on on Fight Tape. Yeah, I don't on Fight Tape, but it's too long. What? Just stabbed me like that. What the hell? What a suplex. That was cool. Oh yeah. Oh, oh my bad. Sorry. <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> What a suplex. God damn. I was just like a uh, Roman Reigns backbreaker. God damn. <laughs> huh? It was cool to see Roman Reigns in uh, that Fast and Furious movie. Yeah. Ho Hobbs and Shaw. Yeah. Yeah, Roman Reigns is there as well. Yeah, when the uh, when the uh, um, the Rock and Jason Statham they when they go back to Samoa. <laughs> yes, yeah, Roman Reigns is actually related to the Rock in real life, yo. Yeah. Don't know I think how. Think so. Um, I don't know if there's a Fast and Furious anime on Netflix now. Oh yeah? Yeah. Wow. It's about spies or something like that. It's, it looks a bit, um, cheesy. Yeah. Well, the Fast and Furious franchise hasn't been the same since Fast and Furious 5. <laughs> Yeah, they're not stealing DVDs anymore. <laughs> In the first one, they were stealing DVD players. I don't know why people. Well, I don't know why there's something still with these DVDs because it's obsolete. Okay, okay. now we're gonna get the last boss. There he is, the blonde guy. It yep. looks like flipping. It looks like um. 
the one, the boss is not out of those and that's without the armor. I know. Death Arthur. Oh, God, the events of Death Arthur was the fucking bitch in that RTD, I remember. Or oh, on them later, if, if my. There was also Dolphinat's fighting game as well, 2D. Okay, game lover. Thank you so much for staying here with us for one hour. <laughs> I appreciate that, bro. Thank you so much. This is why we need flipping three people. Hell yeah. No, nah, we, we cannot let that bastard escape. I know, after last time. Yeah, yeah. otherwise you're gonna get the... Bad ending then. The bad ending, yeah. We really need to beat this guy, there he is. Ah, you what? I keep throwing fucking bombs, man. Ah, there he goes. Fuck's sake. Ah. We almost had him at the end. I know. We're gonna get the band ending because we let him escape. Shit. Ah, never mind, yo. At least we completed the game. <laughs> I thought I'd done it plenty of times anyway, but it's annoying now getting the bad ending. I know. This this is why we need one more person. Yeah. to get the girlfriend. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna get the bad ending now. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, they all die in the end. <laughs> yeah, so what do you guys 
what do you guys think of this uh, uh this video map right here let me know in the comments yo i think say they need to do one now mm. Shall we pass this? Not bad. Second place. And you got the first place, yo. Yeah, you have to collect them um, money things and other stuff. I know, right? I yeah, not... nobody plays with that old man, yo. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh, that was funny, that horse, so. though. I'm gonna create another lobby. This time we're gonna play a little bit of Max of the Round. There you go, in this version. Let's do it. So, as you guys can see, that's the collection of the beat em ups that you can see uh, this game has, yo. Such a great collection, yo. Alright, guys, the screen is gonna turn blue just for a few seconds while I invite. Predator Gaming HD to my lobby. I'll be right back. And here we are. So now we are we are just waiting for Predator to come to my lobby. This uh, how easy it is to to have online gameplay in this collection, you know. It's a great collection. There he is. He's ready, and I'm ready. Let's go. And welcome to Knights of the Round. Made in 1991. There you go. I'm Percival and Predator is Lancelot. Let's go. This game is also available for free players at the same time. I still remember when we used to play these games on Fight Guys. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this, this collection wasn't even uh, being made at the time. <laughs> And here's the first boss. <laughs> that <was> sound. <laughs> Level up.
God damn eagles, yo. I don't know. Five people in the chat right now. Come and chat with us, yo. Don't be shy. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and smash the like button. Yeah, at the moment we are playing uh, Knights of the Round. We are playing uh, Warriors of Fate before. We completed Warriors of Fate. And now we're playing Knights of the Round. Another great uh, Capcom beat em up. Well, in this case, it's a hack and slash. Level up. You need the food, bro. From the other yeah. side. Yeah, the other one. There you go. And welcome to the second boss. around but they're not the same anymore yo. No they're not the same anymore. Capcom now is all about DLC and making money. And Tom's between Resident and Evil all the time. Yeah. Oh bollocks. Capcom Capcom they are not here to uh, please the fans anymore like they used to do in the nineties. The only, comp the only two companies that I agree that they are still uh, doing things for the fans are uh, NetherRealm and Bandai Namco. Sometimes Sega. Yeah, Sega sometimes uh, does things for the fans, but Capcom? Oh my god. Capcom is all about making money. Yeah. And creating DLCs all the time and bullshit like that. You know what I mean? Great, yo. Capcom ain't, ain't the same anymore. I need the castle now. This game is so epic, man.
understand that. Stop jumping off the bloody flap, it's not down to any nowhere. Yeah. I know another one. Dose and dose. That's another beam up thing. That's an adventure team. Yeah, they should have put gold and gold here too. That that was two player anyway. Yeah. But if you want to deck the door then you have to complete it twice. Mm-hmm. You don't get if you don't have a PS4 and if you have a PS2, you can get this game also on the Capcom Classic Classic Collection Volume One, I think. I think it's, yeah, it's, it's, it's even not that Volume one. one; it's Volume Two. Yeah, that those two those two titles were uh, uh, epic. Collection on PlayStation 2. I still got them. And they were also available on the original Xbox. I made one of them for PSP as well, I remember. Oh, yeah, on the PSP too. Yep, that's right. And they made, yeah, the, the made the main collection. They made Great some game. of them for the PS1 back in the day, only in Japan now. Mm. Yeah. Oh, so that's, that's a phone going off. It's annoying. Yeah, I still got my PS2, man. I love it. <laughs> PS2 is one of the reasons why people stopped going to the arcade because there were so many titles that were ported straight to the PS2 from the arcade and that's one of the reasons why people stopped going to the arcade because you could play these games at home <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. Of course, nothing, nothing steals the the magic that the arcades had. Easy. Nothing. It's still happening in Japan, though. Yeah. That's why I wanted though. The arcade era was awesome, man. I still love the arcade, yeah. I know that the uh, yeah online gaming is awesome too, but. Yo, nothing feels the magic of the arcade. It still, feel, it still feels new to me. Still. Yeah, in the arcade you could actually see the person that was playing next to you. And the person could give you tips on how to play the game and everything else. That was so amazing. <laughs> And in fighting oh. games, for example, uh, if there was a, like 10 or 11 people next to the arcade cabinet playing Street Fighter 2 or Street Fighter 3 First Strike or something like that, they would put the coins already prepared next to the arcade cabinet. So the winner would stay on and never, you know, you'll never insert the coin. And uh, the, the loser would have to insert coins all the time. <laughs> That's how it was back in the day, yo. Yeah. It's not like a free free gaming here uh, online. It wasn't like that. Back in the day, you had to put coins in the arcade in order to continue gameplay, yo. 
So it was all about the skill back in the day. If you, continue, if you wanted to continue to play the game for a long time, you had to be very, very skillful in order to do it. Otherwise, you had to insert points all the time to continue to continue the Was game. Was that on Dance Dance Revolution? Yeah. Yo, but that didn't stop us retro gamers to continue playing at the arcade. You gave us even more more uh, will to go to the arcade, to be honest. Because <laughs> it was like it was like a a, um, a challenge for us, you know. Yeah. Yeah, man. And that's how you would see who was the best player in town. You know? <laughs> uh, yeah, I feel sorry for kids of this generation that never had, yeah. never experienced uh, the arcade era. You know? But the theme parts now. Oh yeah. But... The only way that you can uh, play arcades now is going to theme parks or arcade conventions or gaming conventions. Yeah. Or you have to buy your own arcade. Yeah, you have to buy your own. Even though they're there. Uh, the arcade one up and all that, but it's not the same. Not the same. The arcade one up is quite small, to be honest with you. Even with the writer, still small. <laughs> oh no. And when people say that the, the Capcom Home Arcade is the real arcade experience, ah, uh, please. Oh, you please. don't know. What? The only good thing about the Capcom One Marquez is the Tanwa button and the Tanwa joystick. That's the only good thing about it, because the rest, oh my god, what a piece of garbage. <laughs> Yeah, 16 games, Tom. 16 games for 260 bucks? What the hell, yo? Nah, man. I ain't having that. <laughs> That's the entire house 20. Exactly. And you can add more games on the AFM Carry 1. Yeah, you can even add the uh, uh, Sega Genesis games, uh, Super Nintendo games, arcade games. Hell yeah. Yeah, for example, if you want to play games on, on your VGA monitor, you can't on, on the Capcom Home Arcade because there's no VGA connectivity on that thing. You can't, you can't uh, hit the amount of VGA adapter. Yeah. But it would be more convenient if the, if we had the VGA connectivity there. You know what I mean? I don't need it. I'm up into about other people. Hey, yo, 16 games for 260 bucks, man. That's that's crazy. Yo. Should have more games, yo. I stick to my Pandora box, man. <laughs> Hell yeah. Yeah. I'll probably get dulled armor soon enough. Oh yeah. God damn bloody bird. God damn eagles, yo. I know.
Even the activity that we are doing right now is better than the Capcom Home Arcade. Capcom Home Arcade doesn't have online netcode. And look what we're doing right now. We're playing this awesome Capcom game with online netcode, yo. Yeah, two players. Online. Just for that, this is even better than the Capcom Home Arcade. What do you think, Predator? Yeah. God damn, they the lot of light jump at the club. Hey, Maz! Hey, you were a little bit quiet there, bro. How you doing, yeah. man? Welcome to the stream. Mav, have you created a video yet? Come on, bro. I want to support you, but you need to you need to create a video, bro. Just make a normal video. Just uh, go outside and make a video, man. You know, make a vlog or something. Uh, I will ask you every time until you make one. I will ask you. I will be. I will be uh, after your ass. I will be asking you. Have you created a video? You have to create one, bro. Trust me. <laughs> I'm gonna be on your case all the time, bro. <laughs> yeah, man. Now uh, I'm encouraging you. I want. I, I, I want you to get better, bro. You know. I can see that you have potential. Oh, there you go. That's a good idea. Make a video of your dog. Yeah, that's a good idea right there. Or oh, oh, stop it. Put a dog pony dog or something. Yeah. That's what By the way, uh, Matt, this, the the guy that is playing with me is Predator Gaming HD. Predator meet Matt. There you go. He's saying hello to you, man. <laughs> yeah, my friend Predator is the guy that just died. <laughs> yeah, he's the blue one. There you go. He's saying, what's up, Predator? Yeah, you can check him out. He's got a YouTube channel as well. That's Predator Gaming HD. I put something while I'm pressing one button on. <laughs> uh oh, the hammer is coming. There he is. Oh shit, that, that's oh, shit. There's, there's another flipping death had a lot of light. Oh shit, oh. Damn, look at that. There you go, Maz. There you go, that, that's the uh, Predator YouTube channel right there. Predator Gaming HD. There you guys, make sure you get you guys check each other's channel. Yeah, check uh, check the latest video, leave a positive comment on that video and smash the like button, yo. I uploaded the Levi Arte gameplay yesterday. Oh yeah. There you go, Predator. Mav is checking your channel right now, bro. Oh, I need to just watch hours. Yeah, Predator needs watch hours at the moment. He's nearly getting monetized. You get, you're gonna get the golden armor soon, Predator. I know. That's why I keep on that. When I'm not, not, when I'm not full high attack, then you get more points, you see. Yeah. Oh, 
Uh, oh, the watch hours. He basically, uh, for Elite Gaming HD, you need 4,000 4, watch hours in order to get monetized. That's the new rules. The new rules of YouTube. You, in order for you to get monetized, you need to get 1,000 subscribers first. Then you, you're gonna need to get the community tab. After the community tab, you need 4,000 watch hours. That's right. I've been doing it since bloody Friday. And then you, you'll be able to get monetized. These are the new YouTube rules, yo. It's Crazy, kinda yo. bullshit, though. <laughs> it's a lot of bullshit, Predator says. <laughs> I, used to, I, used to be, I used to have monetization back in 2010, and I, and I lost it. So I'm trying to get it back. Yeah, the only, the only guys, the only guys that are making real money on YouTube at the moment are the guys that started uh, their channel back in 2007, 2008, 2009. These are the guys that are making money, real money, on YouTube. Not now, not us. I started my channel back in 2016. But yo, it's been a hard time, man, trying to grow. Tony met me when I was at 700 odd. Yeah, when I met Predator, Predator was at uh, 700 subscribers at the time. Yeah, YouTube's gone very corporate at the moment, yeah, true. Especially now with this thing with uh, Copa. Oh my god. Oh, well, that's not affecting me anyway. Yeah. Yeah, YouTube gives more leeway to people, people like uh, PewDiePie or Logan Paul, uh, KSI. PewDiePie, oh PewDiePie, and those more. I fucking hate them bastards. Yeah, all those, all those big YouTubers, yeah, big I'm names on YouTube. Those I'm are the ones that are making I'm real money. I'm flipping DSP, ask for money. That's another one. Oh yeah. I'll, I'll not that to you to come out, Tony. <laughs> <laughs> He's got some more bullshit information now. So... Yeah, yeah. Ma Mav's got a point, yo. He said, well, start making videos for kids and you'll be sorted. Yeah, he's got a point. My videos are not for kids anyway. So, Mav, you can tell that why I, why I say stuff. The thing is now, man, because of the new copper regulation, even if you make uh, if you make uh, videos for kids, you're gonna lose monetization. You're not gonna get monetized. You you're not gonna get community tabs. Your all your comments and likes are gonna disappear. It's crazy, bro. You have no choice. <laughs> That's why a lot of people are refusing to, to make their channel as for kids. Because uh, you're gonna lose a lot of royalties if you if you put your channel for kids. My you channel for anyway, kids anyway, Mars, anyway. You're gonna lose a lot of royalties. Yeah. Yeah, it's true. It's true. It's really bad on YouTube at the moment. Really, really bad. And all these regulations are going to start making effect in January 2020, bro. That's when you're going to see the big change if you're on YouTube. Everybody's I'm been not, talking about it. I'm not different, no. Crazy, man. YouTube, uh, YouTube is not the same anymore. The reason why this was called YouTube in the first place is because it was about you. It wasn't about them, it was about you. That's why it was called YouTube. 
But yo, it's nothing about us at the moment. <laughs> it's about them. Yeah, we are. Another thing, Master, you see, doesn't realize how many views I'm getting per live stream. Doesn't look at them. It's like a no, it's like a no win situation, man. Because YouTube doesn't want you to to swear and uh, to make uh, adult content, but then if you ma if you set up your channel for kids, you're gonna lose a lot of royalties. I mean, what the hell? What do they want then? <laughs> you know what I mean, Predator? Yeah. Oh, looks like Matt didn't understand what you said, Predator. What? My, t my channel's not for kids anyway, imagine if you can sell. If you watch one of my videos, I swear a lot. Another another bad thing about YouTube at the moment is even if you set up a video as not for kids, YouTube could find something that is related to kids on that video and set it up as for kids uh, automatically without even asking you. That's crazy, yo. For example, all of my Super Smash Brothers Ultimate videos, they all been set up as for kids by via YouTube. No, you can do it. It's not and for kids when you uh, before you upload it. Those Tony. videos originally, those videos were not for kids, but YouTube set them up as for kids. No, no, you can do it asking, manually before you upload it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, you can do it manually, Tony, before you hit so the upload button. Basically, Something if like I that. was monetized, even if I was monetized, I wouldn't earn any money for those videos because those videos are set up for you. It's crazy, man. <laughs> anyway, I'm not here for the money. I'm here just to enjoy my fair. That's Have the same time with uh, people like Predator, MLA, uh, Very really good. These guys are awesome. They always play games with me. And this is what it's all about. It's all about having I'm fun. Just, I'm just on these as the same people. I take YouTube as a hobby. I don't take it as a career. So, even if they decide to uh, delete my channel, I won't be paid about it. You know what I mean? Oh, eight minutes of 30, 35 a day. Oh, God. There you go, Predator has the golden armor. And this is the final stage. And the golden sword, Jesus. How powerful is this thing then? Dotton. Wow, finally, I got the golden armor. And I'm looking like Thanos. Oh, shoot. <laughs> 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 Bloody hell. Yeah, this game is awesome, man. I still think that the best... The best Capcom beat-em-up of all time is Alien vs Predator. Oh my god, what a game. It's a shame that they never put this game in this collection, man. Hmm. Well, you, you, actually, uh, if you buy the, the Capcom Home Arcade, you'll have that game. <laughs> uh, pay, to pay 250 bucks just for that game? Nah. Hell no. <laughs> Not for me. Would you do it, Predator? No.
Yeah, he's very overpriced, man. Come on, man. Okay, I can understand being a bit overpriced because of the Sanwa button and the Sanwa joystick, but yo. Come on, it's not the the reason to to put that that device at that price here. Two hundred. I'm using the North Face right now. With only you with only sixteen games. Come on, man. Oh, dot. Mas, I'm using the North Face right now. Yeah, as you guys can hear, Predator Predator Gaming HD is using an arcade stick to play this game. It's more simple than just having a fucking pump control in your hand. That's what I found for the Switch, Tony, a whole internet adapter table. For the What's the Switch? Switch? Yeah, I'm gonna that one. Be wired. Oh, I can't be honest, man. being I can't be honest, being wireless on a switch. Hell no. It's only twenty five quid for the adapter. It's USB. Really? Yeah, on Amazon. Yeah, really. I might, I might, I might find one as well and buy one. It's a, it's officially licensed by Nintendo, yes, and made by Harvey. Just type in Nintendo Switch Internet Table Adapter on Amazon or tomorrow. Well, this is it's a USB thing, so you plug it your Switch dot, and that's it. Oh, you fucking shitting.
Yeah, guys, sorry about the inconvenience. Uh, had a few phone calls again. Yeah. <laughs> but I'm back now. And this time I decided to choose Arthur. And there he is with his golden armor. And Predator Gaming HD is playing with Sir Lancelot. <laughs> God damn. And this is actually the the last boss of the game. He's very OP as you guys can see. Look at that. Jesus, keep jumping around yo. Yay! Excalibur, ho! <laughs> Bloody hell. What a fight. I actually seen the Disney people told that Stalaber. Mmm. <laughs> it's an old movie. Oh, I'm level 12. For wow, Stalaber. level 12. Nice, Predator. <laughs> that was cool. I normally do that during the, during the, in the day, that mm. near, halfway through the day, not at the end of the day. And here we are, we completed the game. And this is the happy ending, yo. Immortality, there you go. Lancelot said that uh, Arthur should be the king of all Britons. There you go. What a game. After Emily's Bortano erupted, then. Ah! <laughs> the late Bortano erupted. Holy shit. <laughs> and the sound is on the stave. Yeah, that's right, man. The Holy Grail, the Holy Grail gives immortality. <laughs> And this is how King Arthur became king of all Britain, and uh, the kingdom was united now. Hell yeah. That's a good Dave story right there. Uh, Dave. So, oh, wow, that... so guys, what do you guys think of this beat em up right here? Well, hack and flash. Let me know in the comments below. And we've been here for two hours and one minute, yo. We played uh, Warriors of Fate first, online co-op, and now we played Knights of the Round. After Emily's boat in the there's no more Emily disappeared from the land. Oh god. Wow, they even they even put our names there, look. Tony and Jay. <laughs> awesome stuff. And the other one's blunt. <laughs> oh god. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching our gameplay here of uh, Warriors of Fate and Knights of the Round online co-op. Courtesy of Capcom Beat'em Up Bundle Collection on the PS4. Like I said, this is available on PS4, no, they will be my Nintendo now. Switch, Microsoft Windows, One. And, and Xbox One. Alright guys, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Fight on! Ooh, wow.